Hello, Zucata here, the creative director for Robots Frontiers. We're getting ready to deploy our third content update, Elimination. So there's a lot to cover today. Let's get straight to the feature that you requested the most. With the Elimination update, you'll be able to drop into battles alongside your friends. This is a bare-bones version of the squad system. When you choose to create a squad, the game generates a squad ID which you can copy and send it to your friends. If someone sends you a squad ID, copy it from the chat and paste it into the squad window in-game. The game will create a squad and try to match you with other squads. We wanted to roll out a basic version of the feature sooner rather than later. Later this year, we'll integrate squads with the friend system on various platforms to give you an easier, more seamless way to team up with friends. Team play is one of the cornerstones of War of its Frontiers. Elimination delivers another essential feature to support it. The Smart Ping system lets you communicate with your team via pre-made messages. You can press the ping button once to alert your team of your intentions. For example, if you aim at an enemy-controlled beacon, the ping will call for an attack. If a friendly beacon is in your sights, you will remind allies to defend it. If you hold the button down, a ping wheel will pop up where you can choose from many useful communications. Ping is set to the middle mouse button by default. You can reassign the key via in-game settings. Just remember, pings change depending on what you're aiming at. Do you know why we named this update Elimination? It's because of the brand new game mode, Elimination. While Beacon Rush is focused on territory control, Elimination is focused on shooting and combat. But it's not that simple. Victory goes to the team that has more robots at the end of the match, not to the team that scores more kills. Also, this mode has beacons. In Elimination, they work solely as spawn beachheads. Fighting for them isn't essential, but sometimes a lucky deployment can turn the tide of battle. So try to play smart. Smart things can help with that. Just saying. Elimination also deploys two new robots, Harpy and Fenrir. Harpy is a fiery damage dealer. Its signature torso ability fires a salvo of incendiary missiles to set targets aflame. Even more exciting, its missiles inflict a burning area effect on the map. Enemies careless enough to step into it will catch fire and receive damage over time. Next up, Fenrir is the definition of Predator. It can sacrifice half of its durability to go berserk, while this ability love and rear speed increases, and it can replenish durability and armor from a percentage of damage dealt. It's a strong brawler that preys on lighter targets, but can more than hold its own against heavier ones. You can fire up your Harpy build with all new flamethrowers. The new lighter weapon sprays targets with flaming fuel, dealing direct damage and inflicting a burn effect, even if the enemy escapes. A burning target will keep receiving damage over time. Another weapon, Fowlers, are much more straightforward. This powerful shotgun has improved bullet spread when charged. Hold down the fire button. Let it rip. Elimination also brings two new ability modules. Use Blast Wave to deploy a time bomb and clear crucial areas of enemy presence. And fire the Dazzle missile to blind your opponents for a couple of seconds. That covers the Elimination update. Jump into our Discord to discuss all the new features and find co-pilots for your squad. Also, be sure to take a look at the roadmap on our website. Even more exciting content is coming soon. Thank you for watching. See you next time.